Welcome back, viewers, to Let's Play As Your Dreams for the Game Boy Color. We are on our first run through the dungeon so far. I believe we're on level 4. No, we are level 4. That's only temporary. We are on the third floor. We can run a little bit, and the stairs up are right here. So now we really will be on... Uh, the fourth floor. Save data? No. Yeah. I suppose I could be helping myself out here and doing save states, but that wouldn't be a very good way to do uh, LP now, would it? Wow, there's like a event every time. Scale. You guys, kid, by any chance? Uh. Yep. I'm. Oh, that's me talking. I'm Koo. Scale. That red hair and those eyes are pretty. You got some pretty eyes. Pretty unmistakable. I'm Scale, the treasure hunter. Okay. Let, let's take an aside here. If, if you ever play a game where you're a Trevor treasure hunter, you will never have amiable relations relationships with other treasure hunters. If there's another treasure hunter in the game, he's your rival. It, it's like women in chick flicks. They never get along. So, women, treasure hunters, one and the same. My specialty is disarming traps and stealing stuff. But, worry not, because I don't steal from someone at a disadvantage. I only target monsters and bad guys. Nice to meet you, Koo. Oh. I think he's actually kind of nice. I don't know. Maybe he's not going to be our rival? Hey, you can't have more than one rival in a game, right? We already have Gosh. So, I don't know. Oh, 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 oh! There's an egg over there! Got to get to the egg. I don't care what happens. You need eggs in this game. You get a good egg. Actually, we're on such a low floor, I can't imagine it would be anything worthwhile. I'm gonna have like. I'm gonna have like five polywump eggs or whatever. Whatever they are. I already forgot. Oh, what the? Good, good. Gotta go the other way. Yeah. Here's a new monster. What, what happened? It wasn't. A mushroom. We inflicted 10 damage. Were you surprised by that graphic? Because I was. Why didn't we see that before? Okay, we gained 7 XP. And I'm really scratching my head because I've fought these things enough times and they never did that. We don't have to worry about that guy. So, looks like we're going to have to go the other way around. I must get that egg. Maybe I'll get a mushroom. Oh, another new enemy. Press A, that will also skip a turn. Uh, you'll see the difference more... See, he didn't have a thing either. You'll see the difference more clearly if uh, you're playing the PlayStation version. So, we both went up in level. In the PlayStation version, you'll actually, like attack the air, versus if you press select, time will just pass. Or whatever you press there, on the PlayStation. Uh... Which way I want to go? Dust is good. But... <clears throat> well, we'll grab the dust and we'll go down, because I want... I must have that pale sand. I don't remember what pale sand does. No! I don't want. I surely I have something that's useless. Okay, that's, uh, I think this is useless. But I might save it in case I can use it for something. Uh, what does a sap leaf do? Lowers attack power when adjusted. So obviously you throw that at something. Let's give a uh, light seed. 
so it's MP recovered. It's a little awkward, uh... <clears throat> sometimes. Just a, a little bit of a flaw in the, uh, localization. I think is how they say it. Meta herb. Light seed. Okay. Well, unless something is really good, I won't be picking it up, I guess. This would be when it would be a good time to actually come to think of it. God, what do I have? Like three eggs? KT. Um, what does Pale Sand do? Oh, it oh it adds a charge to an orb. Well, that's good. Let's let use our true specs on this thing. Fireball egg. I haven't even seen that monster yet. That's cool. Uh, I might as well use this on the Igni orb. Oh, I think I forgot to mention, I, I believe you can only bring, like, five items into the dungeon with you, and your uh, weapon, your armor, and your monsters count. What did I just gain? So there's a strategy uh, aspect there. This will change your change a monster's uh, aspect to water. So I guess I didn't mention that before, but monsters have sort of that rock paper scissors thing going on. So they're either a wind paper, a rock, whatever. That must be a fireball there. That's not gonna work too well. Huh. I'm pretty sure Ku is fire, so if you hit a fire monster with Ku, he's just powerful enough, I guess. Because he's not going to be especially effective. So I got a fireball, it's probably going to be similar to Ku. And I've got Ku, who is Ku. I don't have any other category of monster, but um, I'm pretty sure those other eggs are just lumps, so they're not going to be that useful. It's pretty incredible, though, to find, uh, well, two eggs, because the, the one is scripted, so to find two eggs on your first run. It's just not as exciting when you're not high in level yet. Atlee. Oh, what a sweet little boy. Oh, there's a lot more characters in this game. I forgot about that. I'm the little boy. I'm Ku, the son of Guy. Oh, you're Guy's son. Hmm, guy, huh? That takes me back. I'm Atlee, the fair huntress of treasures. Another treasure hunter. Can't use spells or monsters, so I fight with my sword alone. Good to meet you, Koo. Uh, that might have been a positive aspect of the <laughs> PlayStation to have less... So these are like one-way tiles. Less characters. Penny. I don't know what the penny is all about. I think that's money. If you go further into the dungeon, you can, if there's money on the ground, at least in the PlayStation version, it would be more money. <clears throat> I don't remember how it works here. Uh, we got a new monster here. Probably going to be not too effective on it. Uh, uh, I thought that would be a water monster. Shows what I know. What is this? Trap eye. Oh, well, that can't hurt. Let's go ahead and use it. Reveal the traps on this level. Now you can see all the traps. Saved us from stepping on that one over there. Alright. Ah, uh, yes. Penny. Red sand. Red sand, white sand, blue sand. You sand. I guess. I don't know, sounds like some kind of Dr. Seuss thing. Uh, let this guy come up to me. Octos. Not the first one that we've killed, so let's see here. We have some... We've been lucky, we haven't... This has been a really lucky run. I mean, you know, a bad run, you don't find any eggs. It seems like every two steps you're stepping on a rust trap and your sword and your... Uh, armor are going down and level and yeah so that can suck pretty bad maybe
Maybe this is a scaled down version, I don't know. Wind gem. That's really useful. Especially early on when you just really need to make progress, you know? To be able to just bring a wind gem <coughs> with you into the dungeon. So you know that you'll come out with something. I don't think there's anything else in here. Uh, these videos are adding up to being pretty long. Rather quickly. Is that the only entrance to this huge area? Yes. So yeah, I mean, uh, uh, this is all in my first playthrough. So let me know if the video quality is good or if it sucks. If you don't like the way I'm doing it. You know, if there's anything you don't like about it. Not, to, not because I'm like a democratic let's player, but I, I'd like to know if I'm screwing something up. You know, I don't want to be lazy. Sometimes there's things that you can't see. I'm paralyzed. Thank you, CUNY. That sucks being paralyzed. I was gonna say, you can't paralyze both of us. What's up with that? So, fireballs paralyze. Huh. That could suck. It doesn't last very long, though, apparently. Can't do anything with it. I might use a wind gem soon. I'm not exactly cached, but I just... I don't know why certain monsters go to a first-person view or a separate screen or whatever. That is so weird to me. I'm My mind is boggled, really. But you can see how much more powerful uh, our combined attack is. I don't know I'm going up. Let's just check this level out, and then we might call it a LP for the time being. Or call it an episode. I, I you know, I want to make progress, but I also want to end this uh, LP on a positive note. Oh, what do we got here? Another egg. My god. Oh, it's another cutie. So probably another womp. That sucks. Uh, I probably shouldn't have identified my egg, because you would have had to come back to find out what it was. Um, uh, looks like you can't use anything that you're on top of. I might save the cutesies for something. They, oh uh, yeah, you can usually sell them for okay. Uh, let's discard this. We don't need that CC. Red sand, so the penny is money. Hydro Orb. These things are really useful, so... Uh, these orbs. When you start to get to the, uh... area of the dungeon where you're a little in over your head... It's good to have that sort of thing. Wind Seed, we don't need that. That's more useful later, when you want to have a, uh... Monsters of a certain persuasion. In order to make you sure you have a well-rounded group you're bringing in. Frost. Uh, see, there we have the uh, element thing. Not so positive, I think. Uh, fire is powerful on wind. And, yeah. But we'll get him down. So another guy with a little graphic. That's cool, I guess. This music is similar to the PlayStation version. If you play this long enough, you will come to like that music. More sand. What kind of sand is it? It's sand. Oh, oh, oh. What? My sand, though. At least it wasn't an egg. I would have been really disappointed then. So, yeah, that kind of thing can happen, too. But, uh, anyway, I guess I'll have to call it an LP now, so I'll see you next time. <laughs>